Hello Muslim friends of the world. A total of 300 Thai citizens from various regions officially embraced Islam in a solemn ceremony held at the Grand Mosque in Bangkok. This event marked a historic moment for the Muslim community in Thailand, a country where the majority of the population practices Buddhism. The event was attended by Islamic religious leaders, including the Grand Imam of the Grand Mosque, who led the recitation of the Shahida. The converts, who came from various social and cultural backgrounds, appeared enthusiastic as they recited the Shahida, the official declaration of their entry into Islam. According to one of the event organizers, Many of these new converts had undergone a process of learning about Islam over the past few months. They were drawn to Islamic values that teach peace, tolerance, and harmonious communal life. This is a very important and meaningful moment, not only for those who have just embraced Islam but also for the entire Muslim community in Thailand. It shows that Islam is a universal religion that can be accepted by anyone, anywhere, said the Grand Imam in his speech. The event was also warmly welcomed by local Islamic organizations, who promised to provide support and guidance to the new converts as they navigate their lives as Muslims. They also plan to hold additional classes to deepen religious understanding for the new converts. With the increasing number of people embracing Islam, the Muslim community in Thailand is expected to strengthen its role in the country's social and religious life. Islam in Thailand, although a minority, has a long history and has become an integral part of Thailand's cultural diversity. These new converts are expected to become good ambassadors of Islam, demonstrating Islamic values in daily life and contributing positively to Thailand's pluralistic society. As the number of Thais embracing Islam increases, concerns have arisen among some Buddhists about the impact of this development on the country's cultural and religious identity. These concerns emerged after news of the 300 Thais who recently embraced Islam which was considered one of the largest waves in recent years. Thailand, where the majority of the population is Buddhist, has a long history of maintaining harmony among different religious groups. However, with the growth of the Muslim community, some Buddhist leaders have begun to question how the social and religious dynamics might change in the future. A senior monk from one of Bangkok's largest temples, in an interview, expressed his concern that if this trend continues, there could be a shift in the long-standing social order. We do not oppose religious freedom, but it is important to maintain balance and ensure that Thailand's original teachings are not marginalized, he said. These concerns are also echoed by some community groups who believe that the growth of Islam in Thailand could affect social stability especially in sensitive areas like southern Thailand, where ethnic and religious conflicts have occurred in the past. However, on the other hand, Muslim leaders in Thailand emphasize that this development is part of the religious freedom guaranteed by the Constitution. They are also committed to promoting interfaith dialogue and maintaining harmony in a diverse society. Islam is a religion that teaches peace and harmony. We hope that with the increasing number of Muslims in Thailand, we can further strengthen the spirit of brotherhood and mutual understanding among different religious communities, said a local Muslim leader. The Thai government, through the Ministry of Religion, has issued a statement that it will continue to support religious freedom and ensure that all religions can coexist peacefully. They also called on all parties to prioritize dialogue and understanding to maintain national harmony. These emerging concerns present a challenge for Thailand to maintain a balance between its national identity, 
deeply rooted in Buddhist teachings and its growing pluralism. In recent years, mosques in various regions of Thailand have begun to fill with worshippers performing the five daily prayers. This phenomenon is occurring alongside the increasing number of Thais embracing Islam, as well as the rising awareness and religious fervor within the Muslim community. Where mosques in some areas, especially in regions with a majority non-Muslim population, were often empty, the scene has now changed dramatically. The sound of the Adhan, call to prayer, from these mosques is now followed by a stream of worshippers coming to perform congregational prayers. One mosque in Nakhon Si Thamarat province, which was once attended by only a handful of worshippers, has now become a bustling center of religious activity. The local mosque's imam expressed his gratitude for this development. We are seeing an extraordinary increase in the number of worshippers, especially during Far and Maghrib prayers. This is a sign that religious awareness is growing within the community, he said. The increase in worshippers has also been spurred by various initiatives undertaken by the local Muslim community, such as religious study groups, Quranic classes, and social activities that attract the interest of both new converts and those who have long been Muslims. Additionally, support from various Islamic organizations and religious institutions has played a crucial role in revitalizing mosques in Thailand. They regularly organize activities that involve worshippers and provide guidance to new converts to better understand and practice Islamic teachings. One worshipper, who embraced Islam just a few months ago, shared his experience. I never imagined becoming part of such a warm and supportive community. Performing congregational prayers at the mosque brings an incredible sense of peace and inner strength. This phenomenon is not only occurring in major cities but also in rural areas, where Muslim communities are beginning to grow and flourish. Mosques that were once rarely visited are now becoming centers of spiritual and social life for Muslims. However, this development also brings its own challenges, particularly in terms of the facilities and capacity of mosques, which are becoming inadequate to accommodate the growing number of worshippers. Some mosques have planned expansions or renovations to meet these needs. With mosques now bustling with religious activity, the Muslim community in Thailand is showing signs of significant spiritual revival, which is expected to continue and bring positive impacts to the wider society.